Hey, hello everyone and welcome back. Todd here. Appreciate y'all stopping by. And that being said, man, I appreciate all the new subscribers that have come along this week. I've been seeing a lot of new names in the comments and that's great. I love seeing those new commenters and the new names. So appreciate you. So if you guys have been following along in the last couple of videos, you've seen we've been working on these uh, this big uh, giant ash score that I found on Marketplace. And I said I was determined to get this all split. Well, as you can see here behind me, we failed. <laughs> uh, you know, when you work full time and you're trying to coordinate uh, your with your son's schedule so you can do this kind of stuff together, you know, that's what it's all about, spending time with my son Evan doing this. Sometimes all you do is a little bit at a time. Just like here behind me in the trailer, we came out last night and split for a half hour. But you know what? It was a little little something, and that all adds up. So the plan for me this morning, I'm running this to the farm and stacking it because I got some pallets here that I picked up yesterday after work. So I'm going to take all that to the farm, get the trailer empty, and um, when he gets home, we're going to do some more splitting in between the next soccer game. <laughs> so if y'all want to stick with me, oh, and by the way, speaking of giant ash rounds, that's the one I got out of the trailer that uh, I said in the last video I'm gonna be making a table out of. So let me get over here so you can see that dude. So the plan with that one, if y'all didn't hear, I'm gonna cut that down again, try to get about a six and a half inch, uh, six to six and a half inch wide piece out of it. And I'm gonna plane that down flat and we'll try to make a table out of that. And there's another cookie piece in this stack here that I'm going to make a uh, little table to go to the end of my couch because it's got two eyes in it and it's pretty cool looking it'll look real nice when I get it done so if you guys want to see stuff like that drop that in the comments down below I know I haven't done anything like that before because predominantly this has been a firewood channel but the way I look at it it's wood related so if y'all want to see that drop me some comments all right enough yapping I'm going to get to the farm and get this stacked. All right, so here we are at the farm. And if you see behind here, that is all the ash that we've split so far. And I don't really have an ideal condition here, as you can see. Um, I did not intend to have this much firewood at one time out here, but this whole row that you've seen on the way in, this end here, like I said before, is maple, and then it's pretty much all oak all the way to the other end. And I really wish, uh, we had some stuff, the father-in-law had some stuff in here along this fence. I really wish I would have started this row over to the fence because it's going to take longer to dry. So it's really not ideal. We're putting this ash behind here though. It's going to come out of there fast, but you know what? When we're ready to get it, we'll just pull up alongside the front of this row with the trailer and just toss it over into the trailer. Unfortunately, to get it back here, I'm tossing it over, so I got to handle it twice, so probably not uh, the most ideal, but um, when you got a couple people, we've just been throwing it up on top of the wood and then stacking it, so uh, I'll probably speed you guys up, get this tossed over and stack it, so here we go.
All right, so there you go. Empty trailer now. And I got a little bit of more of that ash stack. I'll give you guys a look at what we've got so far here. If I can squeeze through here, it's a tripod. Not too bad. And if you notice, a lot of those pieces were short, long. But that's what happens when you uh, show up and a tree surface is already cut it. And we were not going to take the time to cut all that down. So when we're bringing this home to sell, the longer stuff will go in the loose racks and the good straight pieces that are perfect like this one here. That'll go on the throw to the side and we make bundles. Look at this too. I don't know if the camera's going to pick this up. Look at the difference in color. This here is today. And this right back here has only been out here about five days in the sun. Hopefully the camera's going to pick up on that color difference. All right, so let's get home and get some splitting done. All right, here we go. Evan already in progress. Let's get set up. Probably do some time lapse. Well, all right, we got a real nice start of a load here on the trailer. That's about 35 minutes of splitting. And the round pile is definitely shrinking. And this time we will get this all split today. That's what we got left. All right, everybody, it's probably gonna be it for this video. I'm gonna wrap it up here. Our stomachs are telling us it's time for lunch. We've got a fire going over there, and it's calling for some brats and hot dogs. So, with that being said, I want to thank everybody for coming along. If you stuck with us till the end, I appreciate you. Thank you to all the new subscribers in the last week, week and a half. It's, it's been crazy. Uh, really makes you feel good about getting out here and uh, putting this on film. But for right now, we're going to wrap this, this one up. Stay tuned. I'm going to get over and talk to the neighbor about this uh, 
big round that I showed you in the beginning. And also, I've got a double eye around here. Evan will flip over for me. It's going to have some real cool character in it for uh, filling in with epoxy. I'm going to get over there and talk to him. Next video, if uh, he's got time, you might see me cutting that one in half with the steel 400C and cutting this one down and uh, getting that project started. Depends on how busy the neighbor is, though. I'm kind of on his time. So thank you, everybody, for watching. And you know what I'm going to say. Until next time, get outside. See ya.